Trump finally failed in, you know, cooing uh, the election or whatever the fuck he was trying to do. So, like, it's a slow news day, and, and so some people are, are really trying to act up and, and become the main character, I guess. Um, so th this, this nice young lady, uh, Miss uh, Tanya Golosh Boza, who's apparently a professor of some sort at, uh, at UC Merced, terrible school. Professor um, being a white woman. Uh, yeah. Merced is, is, by the way, like in this really shitty, it's in Stockton, which is a hell on earth. So Stockton, no wonder she's also a fucking demon woman. Uh, <laughs> so she's, uh, yeah. So my teen daughter just asked me if uh, Latinx, uh, <laughs> Latinx Means. is a race or, or ethnicity. I told her to read chapter seven of my book, Race and Racism, so we can have an informed discussion. Oh, uh, that's so fucked. That, just to reference yourself. I mean, a lot of things wrong with that tweet. A well, lot of things wrong. Why don't you? What's the what's the biggest thing wrong with that? To you? Latinx, first of all, it's <laughs> an insane thing to to still talk about. I I'm now firmly in the camp of saying like, only white people and and gringos uh, talk that way. Like if yeah, you, if you say Latinx, like, who, and, who and really like, gives a fuck? No one really fucking cares. That that was like a thing that that people you know tried to start in like 2017 and and kind of caught traction amongst like woke people in yeah. 2018. And then, I mean, if, if people are doing it, it's like, yeah. uh, like, I don't, like the, the I moment don't that you apply any sort of critical you thought about it, you know, like in, in terms of like what people want to be called, what they deserve to be called, or, or like, you know, like just like a proper way to refer to Latinos, it just do does you, not fit any of them. Do you two Latinos no, but it's also want to just be like called? A, it's also just like a completely not. It's a complete and total like non-issue. I mean, like it's yeah, biggest, it's a non-issue. It's made the up. The biggest problem you could make of Latinx is that it is like. It, it distracts from any like real issue or conception of like yeah uh, of a uh, specific category of people which like did you don't take the fucking bait who fucking cares if you want to use it let them use it i don't know i'm 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 it, it, no, I'm, it's, I'm, it's, I'm, no, I'm agnostic no. I mean, for, for on me, the on the latinx question i'm i'm there. definitely not agnostic i mean <clears throat> I, I certainly shouldn't be making this much of a stink about it if only because it's it's Oh, yeah, like you, you completely right about this, Ben. Like it's Latino it's itself. Drag on, Latino on all itself of this. as a term is already fucking stupid. Latino yeah. itself as a term is already stupid. It's literally a it's, third of the world. There's yeah. no what it, it's, it's, it's too Peruvians and Philippine and Filipinos and Costa Ricans. There's people who look like you. There's people who look like me. Like there is there. There's the, no, the important distinction it's, it's there like isn't necessarily term. race or anything like that. It's class, right? It, it's it's the people who could come over on shopping trips every weekend to Miami to like buy iPhones in bulk. Cause like the, you know, there's an import tax in their home country, you know, mm. and it's cheaper for them to like fly out to fucking Miami for the weekend and, and like get a hotel and come back or like have an apartment there, Dolly. you know, and, and then go back yeah. to their fucking home country, which is a thing that definitely does happen. I, I do know people like that. Uh, from sure. El Salvador. I mean, I don't doubt it. I, I don't want doubt an it. apartment on, in my I mean, the thing that, that about the thing that pissed me off the most about that tweet was just like, think yeah, of all just the people who, uh, think of all the people who giving want your daughter have, a bibliography instead of telling them like, that. Uh, oh yeah, like Latinx is. It's really it, it's honey. You know what? Whatever when it is, you just when fucking a woman and a man. I don't know. It doesn't much, matter you know, what like the the transfer of information is. It's just like you aren't willing to teach your kid anything. Yeah, any. You know, it's, it's like your kid's like a fucking eleven years old to educate you. And yeah. then out of all the people who do want to have kids who can't because they feel like they don't make enough money or because they're gay like me <laughs> or, or because they, Whatever. Yeah, because they don't who, work at, at a are, shitty school are, like you see Merced. Who are like, who would be great parents? Like <laughs> you, you? Absolutely. You yeah. But they can't. But they can't. You, you would gas. I'm, I'm joking. So I'm, good I'm, at I'm, I'm, your kids, I'm, Ben. You'd be like an yeah. all-star at that. No, I would love and cherish for my children. I would. I would never even be ironic. That's why you'd that's, be so I good. I would about never gaslighting. even be ironic to them. I that wouldn't. is. I think any parent who assigns their children books to read as a, a remedy for their social. I wouldn't let them have wheat or sugar.